No, I'm pissed off. So that did not go well at all, whatsoever. Should I give you a shovel so you can dig yourself a little deeper of a grave? <laughs> I mean, Lord of mercy, you know what I mean? <laughs> We're building a beast of a system here, guys. <laughs> right, Josh? Right. As soon as we get it hooked up, we're gonna run electric heat on That's solar. Good. You will. Can it be done? Yes, it can. With this system. They say it can, but it can be done. <laughs> Coming to work today? <laughs> Look, remember how I broke that thing, baby. You got this? I got this. You can start it. Yeah. All right, go ahead and turn it on then. <laughs> you okay with that, Lee? <laughs> Leon, you happy to see us this morning, bud? A little jig jiggly. It's a little cold, that's why. I feel the power. <laughs> <laughs> Jay! <laughs> Is that a fine enough? Yeah. I'm proud of you. Do I need to worry about the throttle? I, do, I put it on high. I let it warm up for another, I let, let it warm up about five minutes, ten minutes. And then uh, get, put that sucker on high. Oh yeah. And go. Alright. See, I'm stepping my game up here, Josh. Yes, you can feel the vibration too. You'll love it. <laughs> Today's a big day. We got some digging to do, some pipes in the ground, and we're gonna try to wrap this project up. What we're gonna be starting today off with is digging in from our powerhouse to our main house to put a communications line in. That's gonna allow us to be able to monitor the entire solar system from the comfort of our home rather than having to go outside to the powerhouse to see where we're at on our charge and what's going on. The next thing that we're gonna do is head out to the panels and we're also going to be doing a little bit of digging there. The good news with that is we are not going to have to trench again all the way from the panels to the powerhouse. We're actually gonna be able to intercept the existing pipe where it's at, turn it up and make our connections there after pulling some new wire. So it's not gonna be that big of a deal and I think it should go fairly smoothly today. Famous last words, right? water line that we're digging in we don't need to be below the frost line we're only going to get down about 18 inches plenty, I don't believe plenty of things that mean nothing to me but if there's one thing I know to be oh I know what you mean to me I know what you mean Look how tall this guy is. You're tall, almost taller than you. You're almost a teenager and almost taller than me. <laughs> what goes on here? I don't like this. <laughs> That's why I'm not doing the digging. I would be either in that ditch right now or potentially knocking out the house. All right. 
bag real quick. Here, can I put her out? So we have that much motivation today. I would give anything to go inside and just eat food and like, I don't know, watch movies for the rest of the day. But- Why don't we? Well, why don't we? Because what happens over the next- Nine days, yeah. starting tomorrow, we have seven days of the next nine days, it's gonna be snow. Yes. How much snow? <laughs> Who knows? I was I saw something that's close to us, 18 to 24 inches. I saw something eight to ten. Who knows? Yes. Who knows? But that means that, that means we gotta get it done. Even yeah. if like, I mean, it is what it is, right? Yeah, it sucks. So what are what's what are we doing right now? Uh, you should go inside and make me a proving chicken. Okay, I'm, what I'm gonna do, <laughs> what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and put the pipe in the, in the ground, I'm gonna backfill. our data pipe installed between the powerhouse and our house so we can monitor the solar from the comfort of our own home which is nice so next we'll backfill and then we're going to go down to the solar panels I have an epiphany. I thought these were 25 foot lengths. They're 75 foot lengths. As you guys know, we're installing 20 more panels. So it's gonna be two more strings going back to the powerhouse with two new charge controllers. And the original plan was to intercept the pipe going down in the ground um, and cut it and pull it over and set it disconnect on that side of the stanchion. Um, then I realized that my MC4 cable was longer than I thought. I thought I had 25 feet, so I was going to put everything on that side. We actually have uh, 75 feet, so it's actually long enough to come back towards this side where my combiner box is. So we're going to go ahead and pretty much pull that thing apart right there and then bring everything, all the new wire from the charging drawers through that same pipe and up right next to the combiner box and mount a new disconnect and do everything that way. And we actually saved ourselves a few hours of time by doing it like that. verifying there was no power we disconnected them there's no power we're good tear it apart so we got the Combined box completely disconnected. We're gonna go ahead and try to pull it all out by hand. And if that doesn't work, we'll use a machine, right? Yes, but if we can pull it out by hand, it'll uh, warm us up. Yeah, so. we'll, we'll see how big your muscles are. <laughs> 
Is it coming out? Yeah, it's budging a little bit. Hey, Carter! Need a little bit of help here, guy. Just uh, walk it out a little bit. I'm gonna have a big old loop of wire here. Just keep, just keep walking it down. It should go as far as the solar panel. So just start pulling on it, okay? All the way down? All the way down. Good! Woo! I'm exhausted. That was a lot of work. <laughs> Thanks. See all your help. You yeah. pull, you pull in that one. I feel it. Put me in, coach. No joke. I need a breather. I ain't got time. Let's go. Pull your shoulders, Joe. Good job, baby. Keep on getting it, girl. Pull it, Carter. Good. Pull. Now you gotta tie the uh, mule tape on and do it again. You yeah. ready? <laughs> All the wire is pulled through. It was super simple, just easy for me to say since I only pulled one string of the wire. <laughs> Josh and Carter did all the rest. So now we're going to go ahead and set back up, get uh, the wire reels set up just the way that that mule tape is set up down there so that it's easy to pull off. And then we're gonna pull the final three sets of wire through. How many are we doing? Is it three? Three sets, so six wires total. Yes, okay. Five, seven wires total with the ground. Okay. That's it. Good. Make it, make it safe. And that's gonna be it. Now we're gonna, we're gonna attach this to the uh, excavator. Then we're gonna drive it backwards. This looks highly professional, Josh. Well, my thing is, I got the uh, RE I put on there, so we did some bushing. Um, I couldn't get, get down all the way. Okay. So, what I'm worried about is that it, all that Bending. pressure and snapping those portion of the threads off. So, if I have something to hold it down like that or hold it up, have something to push down against, it won't snap in half. Okay. Well, that looks good to me. I mean, yeah. Enough, enough, you okay? <laughs> Huh? What do you think? Looks good. Good luck. We'll watch from uh, up there, make sure everything is not getting caught on anything and it's pulling off properly. Okay, the first, the first couple feet are imperative. Make sure that head goes in there nice and it goes in there nice, yeah. okay? I'm going to pull that portion by hand as you get the head in there. Okay. Once I get the head in there and get it past 90, I'm going to get on this thing and start letting her eat. Okay. Okay? Go, Carter. It is imperative that Carter and I do not mess us up. <laughs> if there's one thing that dad doesn't play around with, it's uh, yeah. electrical work. Yeah. <laughs> so we gotta get it done and get it done right. Yeah. Ready? Tyson! The head's in! Oh. 
start pulling, Carter. Where? The rope broke. It went down, didn't it? I think two by four. I think it broke. I'm pissed off. So that did not go well at all whatsoever. We didn't get far at all before uh, I saw him stop moving and he got out. And the mule tape had snapped off somewhere in there. So he's going to try and dig it up and catch, catch it where it's at. Otherwise, you know, we're going to be digging it up. Which is not what we want to be doing. It's going to add like hours and hours of work to the plan. So... He's not happy, to say the least. There it is! Yeah, I see it. The problem is my makeshift thing, I was looking over there and I, at you, make sure it's getting fed right, my thing, Plopped over, wasn't paying attention, it snapped, and had so much tension on the rope, it snapped the rope. Or cut through the rope, I should say. Alright, that's good right there. How are you gonna find the mule tape though? I need a fish tape. on the end of the uh, fish tape and then he put it down the pipe and started spinning it so the hope is that eventually it grabs the uh, mule tape that's down there and then we can pull it back and retrieve it and not have to dig everything up it. the rest of the way to find it. I got the end of the rope. I need to go out there on that side and feed it. You know what I mean? What do you want me to do? Let me pull his back real quick and see what he says. And then if he's got it, then you can monitor the reels. Okay. I'll just grab on now when you need it. You got it? And he's gonna use the big guns and uh, start pulling the cable. And I'm gonna go ahead and feed. One, two, three, pull. One, two, three, pull. All right, so originally the rope broke with the machine. It's got it all fixed up. Now that I'm feeding it, everything's going well. So everybody got fired at work today. Carter got fired for not manning the wire reels and dropping the wire reels. I got fired for not feeding the wire properly. And Josh, most importantly, got fired for poor instruction giving <laughs> and for also putting mayonnaise on the meat for our lunch sandwiches today. The sandwiches were just not up to par, so you're fired. The, cra the crazy thing is, we got in like six feet with that machine and everything went went to hell, you know? Um, Aaron miraculously, being the, 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 the bull that she is, <laughs> pulled in probably 120 feet so far by hand. Um, it's either from me feeding it like a champion or her pulling like a champion, I don't know. <laughs> the, the earlier situation was, uh, she wasn't feeding an entire set of wire. It was on the ground, it was, it was pulled out 400 feet out and started out to feed those wires. So that's why it happened. We put a uh, two by six kicker against that 90, so when the pressure came on there, it wouldn't actually snap that pipe from uh, pulling with the buggy. This looks highly professional, Josh. Well, I mean, yeah. Enough, enough of you, okay? <laughs> This is editing Josh, walking Josh back as Aaron feeds the wire. So what was that that you saw there, Josh? You saw Aaron feeding Dude, the wire. It wasn't, not really. He wasn't really feeding it. Okay. <laughs> now you don't know why it broke, right? I know why it broke. You know why it broke? Because you're jerry-rigged. <laughs> <laughs> Rock in 90. That's why it broke. Look. See, it, did, it worked last time. I used a two by four underneath, and that's what I should have done. Okay. But two by four underneath, it would have held. Let's put it this way. I accept your apology, and I love you very much, okay? Are the cookies ready yet? i <laughs> <laughs> <Making> cookies. <laughs> you know, you're my favorite, so. You didn't marry me because I'm an electrician. <laughs> That's you know for sure, I mean? yes. But it all falls back on me. I, I put somebody who wasn't, wasn't competent enough to do the job. In, to do the competent job. Competent enough? Yes. Really? 
Should I give you a shovel so you can dig yourself a little deeper of a grave? <laughs> I mean, Lord of mercy, you know what I mean? <laughs> so, it's fixed now, right? Yeah. We're putting it on it, so. I fixed it, so we're <laughs> okay. good. I got in there, muscled it through, and now we're back on track. We gave Josh the easy job. Of feeding the wire properly. <laughs> <laughs> That's all it takes. You got to do the job properly. Okay, so I have six bars to, to watch out for, not four, right? Okay, I remember that. Actually, it's seven, that. but who's counting? <laughs> <laughs> That's right. I know it's right. <laughs> it's, I know it's, it's right. It's, you see how much easier it was, though? Yeah, with me running the show. <laughs> <laughs> Round two. Oh, oh, oh. What does that mean? Like a big dog? There you go. Alright, so. How am I doing that? So you can see me. If I'm jumping in the air like this, stop, stop, stop. If you can't hear me, you can stop. If you're a little taller, I'd probably be able to see you from over there. <sighs> I love you. I hope you know this. <laughs> Hit it again so it's completely out of your way. Step on it. Is that better, boss? Yes, you can see me now, right? Say ho! Like that, you see me jump near like this. I'm not calling you that. I mean, I need you to stop. <laughs> Don't we go with ho when you ho? I got it exactly. I know when to go and I know when to ho. Trust, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Ready? Yes, let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Go! Out. Yeah, not a big deal. <laughs> what? That's not what you were saying like an hour ago. <laughs> the good news is we had fun fixing it. Yes. I like driving the Mini X. Yep. Yeah. And uh, she she admitted um, the defeat on that one. Not a big deal. Yeah, I mean we, Josh we we're, zero. we're sharing the weight <laughs> of the fault there. You know what I mean? Sure. I I wasn't feeding it properly. We all saw that you rigged it up with a rock and like a <laughs> screwdriver. Okay, like you know we can rush have, over that if you want, but you can't should have it. <laughs> should have it. Let's get it done before the snow starts. Please. Yes. <laughs> Tough, right? Very tough. Doing a great job today, new guy. <laughs> You're hired, not fired. Look at this channel here. <laughs> is that too slow? No, it's good. It's much better. See, it's I can't the do it's that. The tone of your voice. I can't do that. You can't talk that slow? No. I'm going to give you guys my best attempt to talk slow. Okay. I'm a very fast paced person. I do things fast. I talk fast. I even drive fast. What we're going to do here is we're going to take this channel and we're going to pull it down. We're going to make it bigger. We're going to potentially slide this thing over and put a disconnect here that we don't have yet. It's actually on back order from all to eat. Wow, I, I hate myself, I hate myself <laughs> now, you know? <laughs> it's so good, so slow. It's on back order right now. So it's been for a month, I'm not sure what, what the issue is, but it's still coming. We don't need it yet until we get the rest of these panels up. So we're gonna put a 90 back on here. Mm -hmm. We're gonna put a junction box down low. We're gonna pipe into the bottom of this guy and just roll the rest of the stuff up, tie him back in, and we'll be ready to install the solar panels. All right, guy, do me a favor. Get on that side, pick that pipe up real quick so I can get this thing cut. Go up higher, can you go higher? Uh, yeah. Whoa. Whoa. What happened? Well, why'd you do that? A little too much leverage. Did, did I say you were hired? I meant you're. Put it down. Fired. Yeah, you're good. <laughs> actually, we're good. Actually, we're good. Better. Pull it down. Pull it out. It's fine. Not a big deal. Aaron. What? Be a dog, grab me a, a stick of uh, inch and quarter pipe, please. Sure, boss. There's actually a better install doing it like this. Oh. I'll put the bell on here and it's, it's, it'll work. Okay. Good job. Extra that hired. means you're actually rehired. <laughs> I've had a lot of troubles today. I've been out of practice, too. Oh, uh, yeah, you're a little bit rusty. I'm rusty. 
Yeah. A little overweight. You know, still kicking so I think. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep you. Snow arrived a little earlier than expected. Let's buy her up real quick. Put this cover back on, leave the fuses out. We're gonna go ahead and reconnect the uh, solar panels real quick up there. And then we'll put the push the fuses in. And then we're back on power. And we're about this close to going inside and warming up by the fire, which sounds really, nice. really nice. Yeah. <laughs> you are my favorite place to go. You're at the end of my favorite road. Above the rest, you're the best I know. You are my favorite shade of road. You are my favorite place to go. What goes on here, babe? I'm having a snack. I'm having a moment. You have cookies and one of those great value barbecue chips? <laughs> Disgusting. I mean, you should be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> then I mean name brand. <laughs> I like to save money, Josh. <laughs>